Is opening three special editions better than opening just two? Let's find out in this video. What's up YouTube, Kaju Yugi Stuff back with another Yu-Gi-Oh! opening video. Today we're going to be opening up five Clash of Rebellion special editions. They are pretty cool. There is one card in here that we're searching for. It's the common chicken game. Still yet to be reprinted and it is a five ten dollar card. So let's see if we can pull people some chicken games in this video. If you're enjoying the channel and want to see more Yu-Gi-Oh! videos, you know what to do. Please drop a huge thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel if you're new. Over half of you watching the video right now aren't actually subscribed. So the more of you subscribe, the more I'm inspired to create more content and just generally open up bigger and better Yu-Gi-Oh products for you guys to enjoy so please consider it now we're going to be opening up one of these for Josh and two of these for Kieran so I'm going to open up these for these guys where they have three and then I'm going to pack that with them and open up these two at the end for myself so we're going to start off the video with Josh's special edition good luck to you guys if you want to participate in my breaks you know what to do just follow me on Instagram at casual Yugi stuff you can find me I do post from time to time not daily, but almost daily, at least on my story anyway. So let's see what promos you can get out of here as well. Let's see what we get, Josh. There's three packs of Clash of Rebellions and a promo. So there's two promos of four. We've got an Ultimalizia Tolskin and a Destruction Sword Flash of the uh, Buster Blade support there. Very nice. And then three packs for Josh. Let's see if we can get him out of three packs of Clash of Rebellions. Let's see. Yeah, there's some pretty good cards in here, guys. I'm not going to lie. You can get Ghost Rares. There's Ultimate Rares. A lot of good stuff. Performage Cilius uh, Launcher. Performer Pal. Ferret Flames. Crystal Rose and Archfiend Eccentric. This used to be like a $50 card. I always pull this card. I don't know if it is still uh, an expensive one, but I believe it might be. Um, that's such a good card. Rizbell the Summoner. Black Metal Dragon. Think might be might be an expensive one, I don't know. But Archfiend Eccentric, such a good way to start. Excellent first foil of the video for Josh. All we need now is an ultimate rare and a ghost rare, and it's the perfect video. Raid Raptor, Fuzzy Lanius, Brilliant Spark, Rank of Magic, uh, Super Heavy Samurai, Blowtorch, um, something champion, and Red Eyes, Archfiend of Lightning. Again, a pretty decent card. One that is worth about $5, in fact. Red Eyes Archfiend of Lightning. That thing looks really nice. Red Eyes Archfiend of Lightning. Excellent. And can you go 3-3 three three with the last pack? Let's see. That'd be nice if we get 3-3. Three three. I think that'd be awesome. So, Brilliant Spark. We have Performage Hat Tricker. Always a nice common. Silver Claw. Return of the Red Eyes. Uh, we have Escher the Frost Vassal. And yes, we did! Three for three. Aromage Rosemary. Unreal. That is awesome. So that is another foil. Aromage Rosemary. Beautiful water plant there card. So out of three, Joshy boy, you did very well. Ultra, super, and secret rare. That's why you enter my box breaks, everybody. So Kieran is up next. We have two of these boxes for Kieran. He's been telling me that he hasn't had much luck opening up the new sets, so he said, Casual, your luck's better than mine. Let's open up some stuff on the channel and uh, get the backing of some viewers to support. So let's see what we can get Kieran out of here. So there are his packs, three packs. We've got a Fright for Tiger, cool, and a, um Engraver of the Mark. So those are the two other cards that we haven't seen from there. And then three packs. And then another three. So yeah, guys, I was doing these at a very good price, selling them on Instagram. So make sure you do and are following me on Instagram if you want to get involved in next breaks. Aroma Jar. Super Heavy Samurai. Rank Up Magic Raptors Force. Cosmo Town. Might be worth something, that. Just our first rare and DD Pandora. So we have just got a rare Cosmo Town, but let's see what else we can pull. Still not pulled a chicken game. Common. That's the one we really want to see. Retaliating C, Performage Hatchrecker, Camel Up, Aroma Jar, Kaiju, the Sticky String Kaiju, and just another rare, unfortunately. But where are the chicken games? Because that's almost as good as getting like an ultra rare a chicken game, seriously. It's a short print, though. And you know what Konami are like with short prints, they just don't want to give them out. Deskbot 005, Performage Damage Juggler, Ferret Flames. Uh, oh, I think we've got an ultimate rare. Yes, we do. We have an ulti. 
insane. What have we got, Kieran? Which ultimate rare is it? You see that shine there on the left-hand side? We have Red Eyes Flare Metal Dragon! Insane, guys. We've actually pulled the cover card. Let's go. Actually, not the cover card, is it? Sorry, this is a card that comes as the ghost rare. Red Eyes Flare Metal Dragon. Insane. It's American print, so it doesn't look that crazy, but it's actually a very powerful card and one that you will use in Red Eyes deck still to this day. So very, very powerful card there. That is sweet, impressive foil. First ultimate rare, got a secret rare. All we need now is this bad boy here in Ghost Rare, which I've never pulled, so let's do it. Oh man, that was an epic special edition as well. So it looks like I'm gonna have a hard time beating uh, Josh and uh, Kieran here, so with my final two, but let's see, you never know. I have to get the Ghost Rare, so. All right, let's see if we can complete the set for Kieran. Which cards is he gonna get? He's gonna get another Fight for Tiger and another uh, Engraver of the Mask. So just repeats of those, but let's see what we can get out here. Okay, so Ignite Gallant. That's spot 005 for Formage Damage Juggler. Cosmo Forerunner. That's pretty cool. Still no chicken games. Oh, I'm lying. We got a chicken game in that pack. I didn't even notice. <laughs> we got a chicken game in that Red Eyes Flare Metal Dragon pack. Oh my God, that was unreal. So that's like five pounds. That's like 25 pounds. Man, he's profited already. That's awesome. That's so good. Aroma Jar, Super Heavy Samurai, Performer Pal. Toon Cyber Dragon is a card that's worth a little bit. And Zhang Che Magician. I know Toon Cyber Dragon is like a dollar or two, and then Zhang Shei Magician as well might be a couple bucks. Um, so that is a very, very cool looking card. Beautiful lighting today. I think these cards are looking awesome. And final pack for Kieran. We are two thirds through the video. Let's see if we can pull anything else. Brilliant Spark, Melodious Diva, Keeper of the Shrine, Ignite Burst, and just another Melodious Diva. But we did get another chicken game. So that's value back. That's literally a five pound card. So Kieran, you did pretty well, my friend. Uh, super rare, ultimate rare, and some nice promos, two chicken games, and a dark metal dragon, guys. Let me know your thoughts down in the comments if Kieran did the best. Okay, so it's down to my two last special editions. Let's see what I can do out of here and see if I can pull anything epic. I am gonna open up all the, all the packs and get them all out because it's a me versus them situation here. So let's see what we can get. In fact, I'm gonna be giving away, if you've watched this far and don't skip through the video, I'm gonna be giving away these four cards. Well, actually what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna give away these three cards. I did swap one of the uh, destruction swords with Kieran's um, engravers. So hopefully he doesn't mind. These are the giveaway cards. All you gotta do is drop a like, comment and subscribe. When this video gets 80 likes, we'll give them away to one lucky commenter at the end of the month. Six packs to go. Can we get chicken game? or the Ghost Rare. I think I really do need the Ghost Rare to uh, to win though. So uh, we've got Performage, Hatch Tricker, Despot 005, Performage, Solitugia, Side Effects, Sky Dragoons, we got an Absorb Fusion. Do you know what? I think this is an expensive one. Absorb Fusion. I feel like it could be expensive, I'm not gonna lie. Don't know why, someone's telling me that this car's like $10, like 15, uh, $10, $15. Pretty good start. All right, let's, uh, man, Clash of Rebellions is a set that's really good to us. We have opened up a lot of it on the channel, but we're doing very well. Performer Pal Camel Up, Ignite Ignite, uh, Cosmo Strider, Black Metal Dragon again. I'm gonna put that down because I do think it's a pretty good one. Um, but I know it comes as a super rare out of an OTS pack, and that's like $15. So I don't know if it is expensive, we'll see. Super Heavy Samurai, Raid Raptor, Tam Tam the Melodious Diva. Extra Buck. Just an extra buck. Bubble Barrier. Wavering Eyes. And Performage Trick Clown. Three more packs. Come on, Ghost Rare. Or Ultimate Rare. Anything. Anything good. I'll take. <laughs> Aroma Jar. We have Super Heavy Samurai Blow Torch. Rake Up Magic Raptors Force. Ignite Burst. And Ignite Templar. Another. Very cool looking and nice and shiny. Ultra rare. Cool. Put that down. Still no chicken games for myself, but it's okay. We move on. Give me something good now. Ignite. Raptor's Gust. Raid Raptor. Fuzzy Lanius. We might have a foil here. Ignite Phoenix. That is a really cool looking card. Oh my god. 
Toon Cyber Dragon. We've got a Synchro. It's Super Samurai Ogre Shoot and Doji. So Super Heavy Samurai Shoot and Doji. Very cool one. Again, I think this might be like a dollar or two. These cards are just so pretty, man. Wow. Amazing. Love the red on that. Last pack of the video. Last pack magic. Can we pull a Ghost Rare? In fact, a little pack with. Ooh, no, 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 no. These cards do not smell good. Ignite Gallant. We have Tam Tam, the Melodious Diva. Deskbot 005. Performage Damage Juggler. Cosmo Sting Kaiju. No chicken games. Bird of Paradise Lost. That is a really cool card. Huh. No chicken game, though. So I definitely lost that, I think. I didn't pull as many good cards as the Box Breakers. But hey, I'm totally fine with it. I'm glad the Box Breakers did get some good foils. If you enjoyed this Clash of Rebellion opening video, please drop a huge like and subscribe to the channel. Like I say, over half of you watching aren't subscribed, so I'd really appreciate it if you did. Keep it casual, stay safe on playing, trading, and collecting with Yu-Gi-Oh cards, and I'll see you another day in another video. Ciao for now.